I just got back from Asta home, so I thought I'd quickly show you guys what I picked up for Aiden. Um, Aiden's at his dad's now, he's going to be back in about 2 or 3 hours. So I just quickly went out and got some bits and bobs. This is a backup, I already got a pack um, about 3 or 4 days ago. But basically Asta are doing an offer, so this pack of um, nappies, um, 72 of them, was £7. And that's really good because normally they're £10 and that's already quite a good price. But now they're down to £7. So I thought I'd go back today and just pick up a spare pack, which I normally just put in a storage room. So when he's out of nappies, um, I'll just whip this one out. I've got these bibs for Aiden because he's dribbling a lot, especially when he goes to nursery. And I don't spend too much on bibs because I find that bibs just get dirty so easily and no amount of washing can get like stains or um stuff like that out and i'd rather just buy inexpensive ones and replace them um frequently so that's what i've learned as a mummy <laughs> ever since um having Aiden. i used to buy the nicer ones like probably like double price and then what i'd realize is that they just get so dirty and the stains just look gross and you, you end up having to replace them anyways so now I just buy inexpensive ones I also got these little tubs it's um, two bowls with lids and I got these especially for jelly I'm gonna make him some jelly in a sec and I thought these would be good because they come with lids and it's actually quite a large tub so I don't think I'm gonna fill it to the top probably like half or something and then he can have that for like dessert and I also got these um, organic lion puffs tomato cheese and herb flavor and these are actually so yummy um, I kind of share these with Aiden because I have them as well and the best thing about um, kitty kind of snacks are they are totally guilt free I'm currently trying to be a bit more healthier and you know kind of be a bit more cautious of what I put in my mouth so these are good I also got him these veggie straws as well because he loves these it's a pack of four I think these were two pounds and this was like one pounds fifty so yeah that's just a little toddler haul for you guys <laughs> it's a Saturday afternoon and me and little one are going to do some baking what have you got there Aiden? what have you got there? shall we do some baking? yes? Oh, where's Thomas? Yeah. There, yes. Let's do some baking. Um, I think I need an egg and water and that's it. And it makes 12 cupcakes. <gasps> Should we make cupcakes? Yeah. Yay. Egg. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Yeah. We have an egg going in there. Yeah. And then we pour our water in. Yes? Oh, now we mix. Yes. Mix. Careful. Mix. Should mummy mix it? Well, we'll mix it together. Gonna mix. Yes? Yay! Time to do the toothpick test. Yep, that's clean. Can I put some on here? Mmm. Mmm. Nice. Mm. Yummy. Mm. It's Eden. Eden. Star. Yeah, star. He's just putting a puzzle together. He's put it together so many times that he's just memorized it all. It's not gone, it's here, baby. Need to turn that around. Yeah. Yes, finished. Yeah. <laughs> Making some breakfast, having crunchy peanut butter on toast. Baba. Yes, mummy's making it. Yes, mummy's making it. And I thought I'd talk to you about this. Um, yes. <laughs> Stop being cheeky. 
Uh, yesterday I was in Boots and I went to pick up um, one of these oils and I've realised that they've come out with one that's extra penetrating for dry and coarse hair so I picked up this one and I'm going to see how this goes I already like the original one so if this one is more intense then I'm definitely going to like this one um, it was on offer as well I think it was like reduced from about 7 or 8 pounds to 4 or 5 pounds Good morning guys, I'm just about to leave and go and meet my sister. We're going to go have some nice lunch and just catch up because I haven't seen her since Christmas. On top I have this um, Topshop leopard print coat, I think I wore it in my last vlog. Um, underneath I have a leather jacket on. Um, I got this recently actually, I'm going to link everything down below um, so you guys can check it out. I've got a leather jacket on and then I've got a plain grey t-shirt on underneath and then I have this um, denim skirt that I got from Sarah. Um, I really like this skirt and I've just realised that the ring pull is a little bit weird, like the shape. Is it meant to be like that? It's not like a full circle, it looks like it's... It's been stood on or something, but anyways, I got this skirt from Sarah. And I really like the contrast of the different turns of denim. So I've just laid all of this. So I've got tights on because it's cold outside, and then I have my um, booties on, which I love and I'm really comfortable. And I know that a lot of you guys have bought them since I've um, mentioned them, but I'll link them down below again, anyways. And basically, they're half patent and half. Um, swear that uh, yeah my room's a mess sorry I've just finished getting ready <laughs> yeah that's what I'm wearing today and then for my bag I just have my little Chanel mini nails are kind of like chipping because of the shellac so I kind of need to go get them fixed and I just have a couple of rings on just sat waiting for my sister apparently she's lost These are some good chicken wings. Just ordered these and they're really hot. My mouth is on fire, but these are so good. Offshore crab, so it's just got salmon. I have chicken wings, and I think we've got a couple of more things coming as well. Definitely over ordered. So I am in, in and over stories, and I've literally had to just buy this scarf because it's so cold outside. Um, I really needed a new scarf, anyways, so I use today as an excuse to get a new scarf um, but yeah it's great on one one we've come to Liverpool Street um, because we're going to go to Shoreditch oh those are nice those are the soft ones we're going to go check out Shoreditch and also go for a couple of drinks as well I actually haven't drunk any alcohol for an entire month which is quite long for me because I used to drink oh there they are the pink and blue bottles I used to drink every weekend. Good morning guys, today is a Sunday, I've just done my eyebrows and my face makeup and um, today I'm off to meet Julie we're gonna go for Sunday lunch and then just like have a catch up I think the last time I met with her was last year I actually wanted to tell you guys about this contour stick that I've just used um, I got it sent to me last month I got like a whole package of stuff and it's basically a new brand in boots and it's quite affordable and I just used this contour stick to do my face. I have a lot of contour sticks but nothing as slim as this and this just made contouring so easy especially my nose because normally I would have to um, say for example I use this Clinique contour stick as well um, I would have to use a brush because that's just way too fat and big to get down the nose but look if you compare those it's really I'm not giving you the finger guys <laughs> really thin compared to these like big ones because I use this one and I also use the uh, NARS one as well but yeah it's really slim and it's just easy to draw on the face and yeah I really like it today was the first time using it actually 
I realised the vlog ended really randomly on Friday when I was out with my sister. Um, so basically we had some dinner and then we ended up at a cocktail bar. And one drink turned into two and then two turned into three. And yeah. <laughs> um, <coughs> oops. Um, yesterday I just woke up feeling crap because I actually haven't touched any alcohol um, since New Year's Eve and I've also joined the gym as well so I've been going to the gym like three or four times a week so in a way my body wasn't really ready for alcohol so yesterday when I woke up I just felt so crap I was just like oh why did I even drink why did I have anything like it just ruined my day because I had so many things planned but I didn't even get through half of the things on my to-do list because I was just, you know, so yeah, I've been going to the gym three or four times a week and I might go tonight depending on what time I get home. You know, it's a new year, 2018, I feel like it's the year that I'm changing my life um, in terms of fitness, health, mentality, friends, work, um, family. Um, Aiden's obviously growing up a lot and yeah it's just like time's just passing by so quick and I feel like 2018 is going to be the year where I just crack on and love myself a little bit more, get on with things and do things that I've really wanted to do. The other day I went to soft play with him and it's the first time ever, 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 he's like nearly two and a half um it's the first time ever that he's wanted to go on the soft play by himself normally he's always like mummy mummy like sit here or sit next to me or come with me but yeah he just went for it and I was so happy because I feel like him going to nursery has really helped with his independence um not having me there 24 7 is just really helping him to discover himself and be a bit more confident so on my lips today I'm wearing a uh, matte nice and spicy lip liner I've actually just overdrawn my lips a little bit because I feel like when I wear these kind of like nudey colours um, it just looks a bit better on my lips a little bit more overdrawn because I have naturally quite thin lips and also I'm wearing Kat Von D's Double Dare which is a lip colour that I love but I've just completely forgotten about it I was just like looking through my lip um, collection and I just saw it and I also like this colour as well but this one's a bit more brown this is Lolita so yeah these Kat Von D liquid lipsticks are good I just finished getting ready and I've decided to have my hair in a ponytail today I haven't had my hair in a ponytail for ever I've got these um, earrings on which I haven't worn before. These were from Anthropology. Um, I've got these in a sale. I think they were like £19. But it's kind of like a starburst design. I quite like it. It's quite statement but then it's not like too big. So I think it's wearable especially because I'm dressed quite casual today. I have leather jacket on, black jumper, um, jeans and probably put on a scarf and heels and another coat on top. Uh, we shall see. But yeah, I'm kind of feeling my hair in a ponytail today because I haven't, just haven't had this kind of hairstyle for a while. I kind of always have my hair down. So, I don't know, maybe I should stick with it. But then again, these bits keep falling out because they're so short. I actually just want a little bit of hair at the front, like that. So, yeah, that would be perfect. But then these bits keep falling down, so I think I need to like, carefully grip it in. And yeah, so yesterday I posted a picture on Instagram. I did a makeover on my friend and I put it on Instagram. And a lot of you guys have been sending me emails and questions about bridal makeup. And yeah, I'm really excited to be going on this adventure. It's just something that I've always wanted to do. And thank you for emailing me and asking. And um, I replied to most of the emails last night. But I got some more this morning and I'll reply to those when I get back from lunch. So yeah. Um, onwards and upwards. Actually, this is quite a good angle to talk to you guys. Um, haven't put my camera down here before. It's basically on a mini Manfrotto iPod, and yeah, coffee's been really whiny this morning. Don't know why. Coffee, what's wrong? What's wrong? Come here. 
You come here. You come here. Thank <laughs> you, give me a kiss. 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 Oh gosh, I don't know what to do. I've literally come to meet Julie um, at one. Um, it's now quarter to one, so I actually have some time. But I've been looking for a space for the past half an hour and I've been into three different car parks and there's no space and I've parked in this car park but I'm not sure how long I can park here because it's more for like the shops around here it's not for like the main area so I'm gonna see what she has to say um, I'm gonna see where she wants to park because we were gonna park in the same car park but obviously there's no space and um, yeah, it's really busy today. Is it because the sun's out? Today is freezing, it's cold, but it's not like cold, cold. It's like the sun's out. So. Got into um, a pub. We actually went to the one that we wanted to go to, but it was full, so we've come into a different one. And it's really noisy in here, so I'll plug them back. a lovely day out with Julie. It was so cold though and I had like very inappropriate shoes on. My feet were freezing um, so I'm glad to be home nice and warm. My battery is about to run out so I thought I'd quickly end this vlog here and um, yeah I'll see you in my next one. Bye!